Hey guys, Kirsten and I were just discussing comps for a seller and duck and thought you might want to know a little bit more about the market. But first, let's start with some general information you might find interesting. Well, fun fact, duck has a year-round population of only 785 people with a median age of 60. In the summer, that population increases to 20,000 plus. There are 3,064 housing units in a seven mile stretch mm. of a beach with a median year built of 1988. It's interesting to compare these stats to Kerala because Kerala has almost 5,000 housing units in a 20 mile stretch, which does include Korova. And the median year built is 1995. Its year round population is 1,000 and in the summer soars to over 50,000. Wow. Both towns have their own niche vibe and they are similar in their rich heritage for duck hunting. Duck got its name in the 1900s due to the popularity of duck hunting on the Outer Banks. We would have had a blast back then. A little bit of trivia. Ladies hats were all the rage and rumor has it duck was one of the largest suppliers of these colorful duck feathers. This is just one more reason duck is the perfect name. That is cool. Um, today, duck still attracts hunters, but most visitors are here for the residential feel centered around a village of eclectic shops, casual eateries, upscale dining, and a town boardwalk. The town hosts wonderful year-round events, including music, wine, and food festivals. And if you're looking to invest in this trendy village, the entry price for a condominium is $389,000 and the entry price for a sound front property is right at 1.7 million. Yeah, that's right. Um, entry prices over on the ocean side in Duck are 687,000. Ocean front properties starting around 1.7 all the way up to 4,750. And for more 411 on the Outer Banks, like and subscribe below. And uh, thanks for joining us today. Thank you guys.